是。Wild Wet Coast is scary, yeah. Imagine you're a centre back that's trying to play a composed game, and then you've got a six foot six madman sprinting at you, whether that's fast or not, bruv. He's sprinting at you like you took his cookies from his lunchbox, bruv. It's not a nice sight. I'll be honest. Um, I've got a little clip. I think about six months ago, I was talking about Wild Wet Coast and my feelings. Obviously, I've had to blur out the swearing, but I just want to play it so you can see that this has been the guy. And if you're a Man United fan and you think that you're too big for him, just remember, Igalo was also your striker. So there's no such thing as a striker being too big for United. He fits the profile of what you need right now. Therefore, he's a good signing. You get me? All right, and finally, we've got my like wild work horse. This was my guy. I'm gonna lie this was guy at one point like he was at Wolfsburg doing the mad thing like as you can see they just signed the guy he's just banged 20 goals in the Bundesliga yeah um so he's not he's not he's not he is not meant to be fucked around within it so the guy is six foot six he's coming to the Premier League you would think that everything just goes perfectly in line but unfortunately he looked like a fish stranded in the I, was I really just about to say that? That makes no f But yeah, he looks so f***ing lost, yeah, because he's like, wait, hold on. I was just playing football. What the f*** am I doing here? Just playing f***. Just, just running around like a headless chicken. That's what he was doing, bruv. So yeah, um, he's still signable. Like, look at his stats. I'm, I'm being deadly serious. Like, this guy can start for a lot of big teams and it sounds mad, yeah, but that's just what, that's what his stats say. Someone like Arsenal, and as much as I hate that club now from the bottom of my I hate that club. They should sign someone like this in real life. Sounds mad, but it's true in it. Like he, the way they whip balls into the box, he'll just be winning everything. He's six foot six as well, eighteen jump reach, sixteen heading. Like yeah, he's he's, he's a good player still. I, I like I, I like him. Yeah, and and last thing, yeah, the guy's six foot six. He can control the ball. Like he's got first touch of fourteen. He's a good footballer still. Yeah, man, like white work horse, my kind of target man in it you get me no this is the funny thing yeah in game i tried to make it in game as well yeah as you can see on the 12th of january 2023 i did the in-game editor signing of wout Weghorst from burnley to manchester united for free just so i can simulate what it would be like in real life and this is what happened eric ten Hag played him one game and not a full game one off the bench appearance in the fa cup and never played him ever again he might as well have stretched out his hand and went bang gave me a backhand in my face bro bro man literally was like how dare you put this trash in my team you think i'm using that that's what he basically said bro man said i gave you one of the best stepwise target men in the game for free and you basically told me yeah, go and do one, mate. I don't respect you. Shut up. Ah, uh, but bruv, how can he disrespect my thing like that? I'm trying to make a video, yeah? And the guy doesn't even play him for more than 10 minutes, bro. He probably brought him off the bench in like five seconds, which is why there's no stats as to how he played in that game apart from 100% pass rate. They probably gave him the ball and that was the last kick of the game, bruv. You get me? This, bruv, Ten Hag was scared. Easy solution. Found it right now. Bang, on the nail of the head. Head of the nail. Nail of the head. Brav. Man was scared of him. Six foot six, 17 jump reach. He didn't, I mean, sorry, 17 strap. He didn't want that. You, brav, he was scared of that in game, bro. But this is the thing. Ten Hag in real life is a bad man and he's not scared of what we what, what caused in real life, bro. It's probably the other way around. I'm scared of Ten Hag. I ain't never met him in my life. He looks scary, bro. You get me? I ain't gonna lie. I, I don't think anyone misses around with that guy. Look at what he done to Ronaldo, bro. He had Ronaldo moving like a... Let me not talk about how he was moving, bro. But yeah, really, I just wanted to express my feelings on this signing. Um, once again, big up the Dutch man, them. This this one once again is for you, like you man, you man really have a lot of ballers in it. This is another one, yeah, where man's gone to the Dutch manager. He's Dutch. It makes sense, bro. Nevertheless, have a good day. Have a good day.